Is Rosen going to get any playing time this weekend? Oh, probably. I don't mean to put that out there, but yeah, probably, man. It's not CJ. It's not, I'm not saying CJ's going to get benched. I'm just saying, dude, CJ, protect yourself, dude. God. Anytime Kyle Shanahan calls a straight drop back for CJ Beathard, Beathard should just be like, no, we're not doing that. Absolutely not. Uh, no. No. Absolutely not. Because that's how that's how uh, Nick Mullins got Tommy John. Not happening. That's how the fumbles happen, the sacks. Let's a hey, straight drop back, five step. No, we're handing off. That would be funny if, if CJ was in, was in the – in the huddle, and every time Kyle called a pass, he's like, no. Guys, outside zone left <laughs> until he got benched. Could he bench him? Seems like CJ has a lot of power in this situation. What are you going to do? Put in Rosen? No, we're running every time. Third and eight. Run it. CJ, you'd be a baller if you do that. Thank you, Anonymous. I appreciate you. Better in this system, Zach Wilson or Trey Lance? Hey, if the choice is between Wilson and Lance, it's Wilson every time. I mean, some people say, yeah, you know, Wilson, he hasn't played that great of defenses, and that's true, but compared to what Lance is facing? Lance struggled against, like, Central Arkansas this year. Wilson would tear that team apart. Wilson is an objectively better prospect than Trey Lance in every single way. You may say Trey Lance is a better athlete than Wilson and maybe, you know, a little bit bigger. But again, it's not just an athletic position. It's a position of reps and 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 reading and vision and poise and awareness and all that stuff and Wilson. If any team takes Lance ahead of Wilson, I'm laughing. No one's going to make that mistake, are they? I'm telling you all this Lance hype was because of Wentz. Because Wentz went to that school and Lance, and Lance had one good year and they're like, this guy. But then he didn't play this year. And you really go back and they're like, actually, he has no resume. Zero. I don't see how he could be a first-round pick.